Hi everyone, it's Laura from She Shepherds. In a previous video called Lambing Indoor, I explained how we organized the sheds. Once lambed, the using lambs would go in an individual pen for around 24 hours, then in a bigger pen, and finally outside. So here we have a cheated cross texture that is lambing. I left the camera in the pen and I kept working in the sheds. Once the lamb comes out, the fetal membranes around that needs to be broken to let the lamb breathe. This can happen by itself as the lamb drops or by the mother licking it. Here I wasn't too sure if she was fully aware the lamb was there but I just did a quick little check to make sure he was breathing okay before letting her lamb the next one. Lambing inside is great, but the concentration of bugs is very high. Although the pens are disinfected after every single one, it's impossible to keep a sterile environment. This is why it's important to give them an oral solution of Spectam to help preventing bugs and water them out. And also to disinfect the navel with iodine, as it is an open door to any disease. Now I want to go a little more in detail about the management of the twins during their early days of life. So once those guys go outside, they will be staying in a field with some other young pairs of twins. Mismothering is quite a common problem with mothers of more than one. A bit stressed or hungry, young or not very motherly, they could go away with one of their lamb and leave the other. That's why leaving them in a smaller field to let them get the hang of it before going with the big lot is a good idea and save time sorting problems. After a day together, they are brought in for a last check and if everything is alright and the bond between the lambs and their mother is strong enough, then they will go in a big field with lots of other lambs. As you can see, the twins are marked with a number on their left side, which makes it easier and quicker to find who belongs to who if a problem needs sorted or if a lamb is mismothered. Make me a good 
Thanks a lot for watching and see you soon for more lambing videos. And again, a big shout out to the lambing team that is doing a tremendous job.